pose as protection for me, but they just made me bleed. No, I'm groaning, no, I'm dying for your salvation. Groaning was written in an, my parents' breakfast room. I remember lying on the ground and just kind of in distress, emotional distress. Um, I believe it was toward the end of my first year of teaching high school students Spanish. And let's just say it wasn't an easy year. So. Amidst that, that definitely was um, cause for uh, emotional stress. But in it, so amidst that emotional stress, as if that weren't cause enough, um, I think just life in general was the reality of working full time and transitioning into adulthood, and um, just all those things that come with being a twenty-something and not really knowing what you're doing or who you are completely, or what your greatest gifts are, or um, who do you think God wants you to be? Uh, just kind of, we're all piling up within me. Um, I was feeling overwhelmed by a lot of things. And this is the song that was born out of that emotional distress, um, groaning. And I remember reading in Romans 8 about the idea of groaning and how the, the spirit groans for us with um, groanings that are basically unintelligible to us. Um, when we don't know how to pray, and also just how the creation is groaning, um, as in the pains of childbirth. Um, again, something's not right here, and we are yearning and groaning in that pain and in that distress of what is not right, um, yearning for uh, something more, yearning for the heavenly kingdom, yearning for redemption and restoration, and how we're waiting for the Lord. But even amidst that waiting, um, we are still called to praise him and worship. It's not just a waiting game where we wait and then we praise. It's like that's part of waiting. It's still worship. Um, so that is groaning. On the album, it's probably one of the most powerful um, songs. It starts so kind of mild and slow and um, soft and then builds into a great chorus. Um, I guess the second chorus or bridge, whatever you want to call it, and it's filled in with um, an actual choir. I was so excited to have a choir sing on this album. I think that was the perfect complement to this to this song because it uh, embodies the idea of all of us groaning and yearning um, and praising together. My dad wrote the choir piece. Um, so thank, thanks to him for being the awesome musician uh, that he is. Uh, he's un unbelievable. 
and that is that's groaning. So this is the last video that I will put up. There is one more song on the album called You're Enough. I'm not going to put a video blog up about that one um, before it's released. Uh, we'll let that one just be a surprise element. Are you excited to have this album? I know I'm excited for you. A rare kind of beauty